next production back here with another video. Um, I'm back and I'm ready to cook with this. So I uh, one of my subscribers made a suggestion that um we do how to make ama piano freestyle. You know how to freestyle ama piano. So this is what I have. Uh, I chose this. <laughs> So we are going to be freestyling today, so I'm going to take you through how to freestyle, right? You see this, the root node, always, always, always know what is the root node. Yeah, yeah always, always know what is the root node. Once, Once you know what is the root node, you are able to travel to places, right? So always know what is the root node. So the first thing is to know what is the root node. So I already talked about scales. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go to my channel, check out the video. So, so you, you see, see right, right now, now I know the scale, scale. So I know I'm, I'm in the minor, minor scale. scale. If you come to highlighting, you see I'm in minor, minor. So, so what, what you do, ne? If you are, if like, like you've got this chords, listen to this. If, if you've got, got chords, chords, you you use this is the scale, scale that you use to freestyle. freestyle. If you've got, got chords, you use this scale to freestyle. This Since I'm in a minor, I'm playing in a minor. Yeah, if I'm playing in a minor, I'll. Since I'm in a B, the root note is B, so I have to come here and change it to B. And, and then, since I'm in a minor scale, I have to choose pentonic, minor pentonic. If I was playing in major, I'll play major pentonic, but I'm in a minor. Yeah. So I'm gonna show. I'm going to play two parts and show you what, what I'm talking about. And, and you make sure you select the pattern that you are going to freestyle in, right? So you, 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 you select the pattern. And, and the, the pattern, pattern should be at least 16 bars. bars. It shouldn't, shouldn't be 4 or 8 because, because that's too small. So, so now, this is how you freestyle my camera. Yeah, so this, this is how you freestyle. freestyle. Let me change the... Let me change the, the sound. I was using... Yeah, that's one. So now, now before, before you record, record you have, you have how, to how to record, record now. now. You press, press here, you say notes and animation. animation. Alright, then you can, can go, go in here just to see what you are playing.
doing when you have the the chords. chords. Yeah, that's, that's the first step of freestyle. So now, now the second, second time, time on your freestyle, freestyle you, you have, have to come, come with these. Um, this, this is, is the second time on your freestyling, right? right? When, when you're you freestyling with the bass, bass it's, it's even much, much easier. Yeah. So, so I'm, I'm going, going to delete this and paste the pattern again here so that you can see right. what I'm talking about, right? So I'm going to delete. So uh, let me just, just make this right here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just make unique here. You see, I'm going to make unique. unique. I'm going, going to delete this thing. Yeah. Yeah. And, and then I'm going, going since, since I'm freestyling, freestyling with the bass, it doesn't, doesn't I don't, I don't need, need to play in the pentonic scale. I can play with this scale, um, other, other blues. Yeah. yeah, this so is the one, one that you should really get used to. <laughs> Let me change the scale here, yeah. other blues. Yeah, yeah. you see, see it sounds, sounds, you know. <laughs> this one and, and then just, just put, put the, the chorus, chorus. Uh, any chorus is fine no? Identify the root note, 
Second, Second step, identify which scale, scale you are in. Are you in a minor, minor scale? You identify, are you in a major, major scale? scale? Yeah. Then the second step is to come here, here you right, right click, right click, right, right click this keyboard team, right, right click, click it. And, and then you select, select your root node, node which is B, as you see, I was in B. B. Since our, if you are using chords, you are going to use minor pentonic. If you are using minor, if you are using major, you are going to use major pentonic. And if, if you are using, using a bass, bass and, and there is no chords, you can use other blues. So guys, I that's what I had for today. Yeah. I hope you learned something, and I'm out.